What is going on, everybody? This is Stryker, welcoming you to episode number 126 of my Minecraft Let's Play, guys. Now, in the last episode, we were around this area doing some caving. That's the way out. We came down here. There was some lava business going on. I lit up a little bit, went into here, and talked about what I was going to be posting next, which I talked about the potential of a vlog, which has already come out and a plethora of other things, I do believe. So we are here in the pre-release version of Minecraft 1.9.1. That's right, guys, we are already updating from regular 1.9, and I think a big issue with that, hold on, how many frames am I getting? See, okay, we're, we're good, you know, 53, 55, 57, you know, 40, 45, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, but anyways, <clears throat> a lot of people are noticing a chunk loading issue that there the chunks are loading in but they are very very slowly doing as such now i haven't had a ton of issues with that mostly because for the most part i've been underground here for minecraft 1.9 but also i don't have a very large render distance i only have a eight chunk render distance it used to be higher but minecraft is becoming more and more uh, i guess what is it more painful on the computer <laughs> for it to run. It's just becoming more and more demanding, really. So my computer is struggling a wee, a wee bit, you know, just, just a wee bit, and that's, that's perfectly okay. It happens. My computer is not the greatest. I'm using a laptop that I got a couple years back when I started college, so it's not the greatest of specs. It's not the greatest of equipment by far, but I'm running everything to the best of my ability, guys. So we're here, just trying to just trying to play, you know? Just trying to play some Minecraft. I'm not gonna let anything persuade me to quit playing this game. I don't think, I think I've said this before, but I don't think that my Minecraft Let's Play will ever end on this channel. Now, I may change up what I'm doing, everything like that. I do plan on upgrading my computer. This goes along the same subject line here. I do plan on upgrading my computer. <clears throat> Goodness, I don't know what's going on with my throat. I was perfectly fine until I started recording, but anyways. I do plan on upgrading my computer, but I can't do that until I actually have, like, money. Because I am a poor college kid. But I graduate in May, so I will have plenty, plenty, ooh, not there, there, that's perfect. Plenty of cash, for sure, to upgrade my computer come the end of May, potentially June, maybe as late as July. But I don't think any later, because that's... Basically what I've said is going to be my first real investment, so to speak. Where's the skeleton at? We're taking jump peaks, and we're making sure we don't get shot into that lava. Lava is an issue. A very, very big issue. Let's go ahead and patch this bad boy right up real quick, and then back away from it some. I think he's a... He, he might be around the corner and up some, but I don't know. So anyways, yeah, so I will be upgrading my computer and everything, which will allow me to play more games, or they will allow me to play games that are more demanding, such as CSGO more often, and be able to record without having, like, 20 frames whenever something happens on the screen. So, who knows what this channel's gonna do? <laughs> to be completely honest, I don't know. I love Minecraft all the way down to the bone. I don't care what people say, you know, I'm, I'm 21 years old. But Minecraft is awesome, you know? It was kind of like... I wouldn't say it was my first computer game, but it was close to my first computer game. But I don't know, there's just something about this game that allows you to express your uh, your creativity, it allows you to do all other kinds of things, venture on, and just challenge yourself, I guess, as a video game player. Because this isn't the, uh, the typical experience here. I think we got everything. So I think we're good in that aspect, but yeah. So that was an extremely long tangent, basically to say that I don't think we're ever going to end this, uh, this series. You know? Worst case scenario, we're just gonna transform this series into another one. We're not getting rid of this world or anything like that, but I mean, like, if people are absolutely done with the whole Minecraft Let's Play thing, because I know that's really, really big on YouTube, but, you know, people might get tired of that. People might not care to watch a, a person play through a world of Minecraft, so we might just turn it into, like, a building series. But that's only if and when this series were to lose all interest completely or whatever. So I am speaking completely hypothetically at this point, and I've been on a, quite a tangent. And it's uh, four and a half minutes or so into the video, and I don't think I've said anything about Minecraft besides the future direction of Minecraft on the channel and such. Did I miss anything on the ceiling? I don't believe so. That's fine. It's a hole down there. I don't think anything's going to spawn down there, though the light level's probably low enough. Does the cave end here, or does it keep going? No, it doesn't. Okay, cool. <coughs> I seriously haven't had to clear my throat for, like, 
a week and a half, and then I go to record, and now I have to clear my throat. What are you guys doing to me? Maybe it's Minecraft. Huh! That was a good dodge. Maybe Minecraft is just... What, landed on torch? Yay, free... gravel. Yay! Anyways, maybe Minecraft is just killing my immune system or something like that. Like, there's just something about it that triggers my immune system. While we're here, I'm just gonna make a trash can. Let me pick up this piece of cobble. I feel bad for leaving it behind. I don't need flint, the bow, the rotten flesh. I guess I keep the bones just in case. <clears throat> yeah, okay, I don't need any of that junk. So we'll just leave that there. It can despawn on its own, or it can stay there forever, as you have to be within the loaded chunk for five minutes before something despawns. So who knows? Does this go up to the surface? It does! It does go all the way up to the surface. So we're going to leave that there, and we're going to go down the next branch. Now, to be completely honest with you, I have no idea where this cave was located at. I forget, you know? It's been that long. The last time I was in this world was when I was doing the last set of episodes, which probably was about... two and a half, three weeks ago? Something like that. <clears throat> Maybe even a little longer. So, well, goodbye, Iron. You had a chance. So yeah, it's been a while since I've been in the Let's Play world doing my thing. Oh no, gravity! It would be a good use of our gravel though. Give us a nice gravel bridge to walk across. Just got the sword out in case. Whoop. Lighten up the area real quick here, and then I've already come from this area, that's right, and then I drop down. So I did review the footage of the last video prior to just jumping in the world and trying to figure it out. So I did know that we were caving. <coughs> And that's how I knew that I was talking about a vlog series, or not a vlog series, rather, a vlog video that I could have posted. So I'm not completely lost. I tend to do that when I haven't visited things in a while, which, speaking of, the next series of videos that will be here is the Sky Element, as long as we are continuing on the pathway. I've been throwing up some more random videos recently, and I don't know if you guys like that, but I personally do enjoy it. I've got a bunch of other content that I can post instead of just the series over and over, if that makes sense. Uh, so, you know, let me know what you guys think of that. But anyways, the next set of videos that are going to be coming onto the channel, in terms of series rota- Ooh, I just broke the block that I put it on- is the Sky Element series. Now, I recorded all the way through episode like 17 or 18 in like one or two sessions just because I was enjoying playing that map so much. So there's nothing against it by any means, you know, I loved I loved playing the Sky Element and I, I'm super excited to get back at it, but like I'm almost out of footage entirely. Oh no 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 no. What happened? What'd you do? Did you fall in a hole? Aw, poor thing. Let me just put you out of your misery. Wow, one shot with a bow. Yikes! Anyways, so yeah. I haven't been playing that since I recorded all of those episodes, but that is entirely okay, like I said. I am ready to get back into it and get recording, and I'll probably end up getting re-addicted to it and end up playing for the matter of a couple of couple of hours, couple of recording sessions. So to, Whoa, okay, that's another thing with the two hands, is you place copious amounts of torches if you have torches in your free hand. Do I have any extra wood? I do not. So we are... Oh, you can't you can't shift-click that up in there. Okay, so we're actually almost out of torches, unless I put torches in my ender chest. And I think, if my memory is correct, I had a ton of cobblestone. And that was it. Just a ton of cobble chilling in my ender chest, because I was using a bunch of it for the huge Mall of Minecraftia mega build that we've been working on. So, I don't even know if I have any, any supplies. I could go back down to that other branch and then up to the surface via the water stream and snag some wood, but I think we'll be okay with the amount of torches we have. I wasn't sure how... See, th did you see that? There you go. Do you see that? Right there. Top right corner of the screen. What's with that? Some things do load weird for me. Not a whole lot, but that's one of them. So anyways, <clears throat> I might run out of torches, like I said. Throw one up there for extra lighting. But that means we will have to be heading home. This has been definitely, definitely a very great trip here. Got tons of stacks of iron here. One, two, three, four, and almost a half. Plus all of this coal, all these coal blocks. Absolutely fabulous, because I've been running out of coal with all of the ridiculous amount of building I've done. I think I went down there and it was clear. I just didn't clear this way. Let me just double check one more time that we got everything this way. I think everything is pretty decently lit up. So, let's head on back. Let us see what was over this way. Um, 
I got some gunpowder. That's from where I killed the creeper. Is that a stupid water stream? That was a stupid water stream. We'll break that block. All right, we went down, so that's done. All right, I feel like there was at one point, uh, I, I remember dropping down there. See, I, oh, creeper XP. Oh, I am so close to level 30. I'm like three XP orbs. Okay, so we explored up that way. This is on the left, so this is back. This is on the left. Uh, did I get losticated? I think I got losticated. Oh no! Oh no, goodness me. Yeah, because that's on the right. <clears throat> yeah, that's on the right. I feel like that torch isn't supposed to be there. How did I get to this spot? How did I get here? What is this way? That was that was a vein of, of stuff. Okay. Okay, I'm lost. I'm officially lost. Call it right here. Call the lost police. But you know what? We're close enough to the surface. Yeah, I remember this area. Ta-da! Are we even close to home? What are my coordinates right now? Hold on. F3. Um, we're actually kind of kind of semi-close, right? It's 700, negative 700 are my coordinates, aren't they? Something like that? Well, let's just uh, let's wander around this direction, see what happens. Might as well. We got nothing to lose. We do only have 19 steak on us. 18 now, as I have consumed one. So we need to be careful with that. And we need to refill our food. Wow. I am getting 20 frames now. 30. 30 is respectable. I can deal with 30. Because that's basically what I play everything else on. Yes, I did see the coal on my left, but I am uninterested. I just want to get going. Alright, cool. Did not fall in the hole. So this is nice. Gets, gets a little bit of terrain. Just exploricating. Yuck. Floating things. Gross. Hopped over a big ravine, that's fine, that's fine, no big deal, and actually it wasn't really even a big ravine. It was just kind of tiny hole. Aren't, aren't my coordinates a, ne a 700, negative 700? Isn't home this way? This doesn't look very homey. I don't remember it in an extreme hills biome being up here. You know what? I know which way we're going. Let me get that off the screen for you. Look at how big those trees were. Hold up. First off, look at the Grinch's Mountain. What is that? What's that called? They had a name. Look at how big those trees are over there, though. We're going to explore. We're already out here, we might as well. Have you guys seen that? It's the the Jim Carrey movie. Where he's got like the big mountain, like curly cues on the end, because he's... It, it, anyways. Go watch that movie. I know it's not Christmas time, but you go and watch that movie, and then report back to me. And tell me what you saw, okay? Tell me if you enjoyed it. It's good, but just, what, what, what is this biome? What are we in right now? We should be in like an Extreme Hills, right? We are in a... Extreme Hills, yeah, okay. I had to find it, because it's changed. What is this? Extreme Hills... Plus, is this really just part of Extreme Hill? How'd I get that XP? What'd I do? I don't remember grabbing anything over here. Look at how big this tree is! My goodness. That's crazy. All of these trees are like ridiculously huge out here. Is this like a, a new update thing? Is this part of Minecraft 1.9? Did I miss something? Did I miss new terrain? Is this maybe home? Or is it negative 700, negative 700? I don't even know my own coordinates. I do have it written down, or rather not written down. <sighs> Reaching for the wrong buttons. <clears throat> I do not have it written down. I have it typed out in a Word document that I saved just in case. But look at this area out here. I'm, I'm, I'm generating a ton of new chunks, which is good and bad. Takes out the future exploration if there's another large update, which changes the way that the world generally is this floating to. Minecraft. We've got to talk about this. Even if this isn't floating, why is there a sky island in the middle of nowhere? What is it? This is a chunk border right here. I guarantee it. This is a chunk border. So weird. Oh my. Maybe we'll find something crazy out here. I don't know. We found a flound. <laughs> we found another flower forest type area. It was very small, but there were nice little flowers out there. I feel like this is close to home. It has to be, because that looks like there would have been some clay, but I have consumed it. Where the heck are we going? Is it zero, negative 700? Guys, I play on too many Minecraft servers and worlds. I don't even know my own coordinates. And I would love to see my beacon up in the air, and I probably could have, except my render distance is only eight chunks, so I gotta be within like 100 blocks of my, my settlement. 
So I am completely lost, and we are at that 15 minute mark, so I'm just, I'm gonna make sure I get home, guys, and I will meet you all there for the next episode. This is gonna be dangerous traveling at night, and I don't even have my shield on me, guys, so... Oops, wrong button. Again, I'm just fumbling with buttons today, guys. Apologize on my behalf. I apologize. Did you hear that car outside? Absolutely obnoxious, guys, but thank you so much for watching. Have a great day, everybody, and I will see you all next time.